if some of you guys have heard about the first names of Africa, like several persons of Africa, they, they're very corrupted. I'm talking about the president of my country, President Paul Beer. The current president of Cameroon, this is Excellency President Paul Beer. He's married and has three kids. His youngest kid is 13 and his oldest kid is 35. He's about 79 years old right now, and he's ruling for like 29 years. He has no power as head of state on the 6th of November 1982. He was a peaceful volunteer transition upon his resignation of the president of Cameroon, the SNZ, President Amid, Amado Ahijo. That's the person he succeeded from. And he succeeded the president from like an affair with his um, health administrator. Like he had to pick up something else, something like an illness of the ex president, so he can donate his power to him. Pogba was born on, the, on February 13, 1933, in the village of Bomaka, in the south region of French Cameroon, in which is located the southwestern and south central portion of the Republic of Cameroon. The position of President in Cameroon is elected every seven years since the enactment of the 1996 Constitution. He was originally five years in the 1972 Constitution, but the President has been President for 29 years. That means he has won several terms since 1982. There have been several elections, like seven terms, about four times, and he has won all the four times. He is very corrupted, and he has a lot of work, both in foreign banks and national banks. Pogba's attempt to make Cameroon a democratic society and a modern nation was to introduce a code of penal procedure for improving the dispensing of justice and guarantee for the protection of civil, civil liberties and mental integrity. The right to a fair trial and presumption of innocence, that's what he considers as his king of rule. He tries to bring everybody together but he failed because of it, because so many people in the country don't like him. He doesn't want to leave. He doesn't want to give power to the next person to rule. He wants to keep on and turn the country as a kingdom. The last time is one of determination, perseverance, dedication, and hard work. The last story shows how those with little to nothing can use education to transform their lives. He's, he's a very educated man, and at least there are several degrees. He has at most 17 degrees and four PhDs. So he, he tries to encourage all the citizens of Cameroon to be what he becomes. So he's been a long term president, but we think he's done the best for the country. Thank you.